it's also it goes beyond just musical worship and it goes beyond just you know saying words of admiration to God obviously that's such an important part of worship but we also worship him with the way that we live and the way that we speak about him and the way that we conduct ourselves in our daily life so it even says like for great is the Lord and greatly to be praised. He is to be feared above all gods. So when they say gods, like in the pagan cultures, they believed in other gods. And like even now, um, it's not as pervasive in our society, but other things like idols can be pretty pervasive. So what I mean by that is just uh, people idolize marriage, people idolize money, people idolize sports or recreation or just being impressive or having a lot of accolades so we can idolize a lot of different things necessarily like we're not all saying hey i'm gonna worship this god or this god like but we do put things we put things on a god platform that don't belong there so a really great way to worship the lord is by setting those things aside and just putting god where he rightly de- where he rightly belongs on the platform and just giving him our full attention, our full praise, our like all of our love, you know what I mean? So just his glory is revealed in that because when we are living for his glory, it is seen in our lives and people notice a difference when we are living for him versus when we're not. So my my friend actually jokes a lot. She's like, oh, I can tell you didn't read the Bible today. And I was like, what? <laughs> but it's just different because you're centering yourself in the greatness of God and just his holiness and just how perfect and set apart he is. And then when we remind ourselves of that, it's easier to live as a people who is also set apart for him. So yeah, we glorify him by the way we live and his glory is so revealed in our worship of him because how could it not be? You know what I mean? When you're just singing and you're just declaring his glory, it's just so evidently seen. So that's the first way that his glory is revealed.